Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're making double lemon chicken. D double lemon chicken. And we're making green beans. And we're making mashed cheesy cauliflower. Let's get started. First ingredient called for a preserved lemon, but I could not find one, so I'm just gonna make a regular lemon, semi close to what I think the preserved lemon is gonna taste like. So we're gonna roughly chop this and stick it in this bowl, and then we're gonna cover it with sugar, which should get rid of the initial twangy sour taste. Now that our lemon is soaking in sugar, we're going to start on the green beans first. I went ahead and pre-prepared these by cutting off all the tips and chopping them in half to make them a little bit smaller in size. Next up, we're going to put one whole stick of butter in here. Stood that right on in there. Next up, we're going to put half and half beef broth and chicken broth to completely cover them. Start off with beef. Use about half the container of that. Next up we'll do the chicken. Roughly half of the container of that. Each of these containers is four cups, so it was about two cups each. Next up, we're going to season lightly with salt. Add in some fresh ground pepper. Then we're going to put this on the stove. Turn the heat on high. Bring it to a boil. Once it turns to a boil, I'm going to reduce the heat to medium low and let it sit for about 20 minutes at that temperature. Next up we have our cauliflower. We're going to roughly chop this up and we're going to throw it in this pan with about half a stick of butter and then we're going to bring that to a boil. I'm going to roughly chop this up real quick. Now we're just going to fill this up with water. Now we're going to throw about half a stick of butter in there. Season with a bit of salt. Some pepper. We're going to turn the heat on high. And bring that to a boil and also let that sit for another 20 minutes or so. Up next for our chicken we need to preheat the oven to 400 degrees Start next up. We need to heat our Dutch oven on high heat with roughly two tablespoons of Olive oil While the Dutch oven heats up we're gonna go ahead and smash our five cloves of garlic Been letting this chicken sit out for roughly 30 minutes or so to Raise the temperature of it a little bit just so it cooks evenly in the Dutch oven. Uh, before we throw it in the Dutch oven, we're going to sprinkle a little bit of salt over top. Season it with some fresh ground pepper. Now the pan is warm. We're going to add the chicken breast in, skin side down first, into a nice sizzle. Mm 
Next up, we're going to add our garlic. And a little bit of thyme. I'm going to let this cook for roughly two to three minutes on each side until golden brown. While we wait for that, we're going to take our other lemon and we're going to slice this into very thin slices, roughly eighth of an inch. Alright, it's been roughly three minutes on both sides, so I don't have a big enough Dutch oven to cook all eight pieces at once. So, I'm going to take these out. And I'm going to put the other three in. And now that the second batch of chicken is finished cooking, Add the original chicken back in. I'm going to add one tablespoon of cherry vinegar. I'm going to let that reduce by half. Next up, we're going to add two tablespoons of soy sauce. Three and a half tablespoons of honey. I'm going to roughly guess what three and a half tablespoons of honey is. That's one. That's two. Three. And a half. Reduce that down to medium-high heat. Add in the preserved lemon. Add in the thinly sliced lemon. And mix all this in there. I'm going to add one tablespoon of water. Then we're going to add this to the oven for 10 to 15 minutes. Meanwhile, while that chicken cooks, we're going to go ahead and turn the green beans off and let them cool down a little bit. And we're going to turn the cauliflower off and then we're going to go strain this now. I'm going to pour this into our strainer. Then we're just going to dump that back into the pot. We're going to get our potato masher out for this. And we're just going to mash this cauliflower up. I'm going to add one bag of shredded cheese. We're going to add three tablespoons of sour cream. Then we're gonna take our potato masher and mix that all in. Now the chicken is done in the oven, I'm going to go ahead and put that on a plate. Next up, we're gonna add our cauliflower. Then we're gonna add some green beans and to top it off we're going to add just a little bit of parsley to the top of the chicken.